Kid be one of them funky ass This is what happens when you don't like the coals early enough. That's looking better now. <laughs> it's what? It's actually lit. Oh, it's lit before. Barely. <laughs> we'll just sit and spectate, Simon. Just leave Dal do it all. Should we get takeaway? <laughs> <laughs> This is the first attempt at a barbecue in 2018. It is actually the first barbecue of the year for us. Is it your first barbecue? Yes, this yes. is our first barbecue. We are breaking our 2018 barbecue virginity together. So far it's going very well. Daryl is flat fanning his charcoal with... Is that a piece of Sophia's car? <laughs> yes. Really? Oh yeah, look at those. Yeah proper dad creeper shoes and the black socks that's going on here he goes again fanning his flames fan 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 first barbecue of 2018 with any luck we'll be eating by 2019 as you are the grill master of tonight though we have to publicly support you them's the rules of the barbecue do you know that no. there are unwritten rules of barbecuing Number one, being publicly support your grill master, which is Daryl in this instance. Are you getting a picture of this though, I'm not? I will do in a minute. So even if the meat or the veg, whatever they produce, ain't fine, you publicly declare it's fine because they're the one cooking. Although in this instance, in a random barbecue, Lucy has done most of the prep work, yet we will thank Daryl <laughs> for doing everything because he's the man that puts the meat on the barbecue. That is another barbecue rule, I think. The people behind the scenes always get the praise. Bed, Grill rule number three, barbecue rule number three, you cannot leave the barbecue unattended. Mm -hmm. I think you're supposed to wait until it goes completely wide, don't you? Yeah, that means then you can cook on it. We're making this up as we go along. Probably all gonna die of food poisoning. <laughs> we'll die after, after our day off, yeah. We're going to see Avengers tomorrow. I'm very excited. We'll probably still be waiting for the coals to heat up though. So. I would offer you support, but I think that's another barbecue rule, isn't it? No, no man may challenge another man's barbecue. I'll say things like, do you need a hand? Or, I think you should do it this way. Would that be a cardinal sin? Lucy's pregnant. Who ate all the food? <laughs> Me. She is actually pregnant. Just a fatty. Okay, this is a new thing. Daryl's just put dried grass on top of the barbecue. Perhaps you should have cleaned it before you brought it round to like cook on. These are not barbecue rules. You do not have to put dried grass on your barbecue. That's just damn crazy. Go! Lucy, what just happened? I just got told to leave it alone. She broke barbecue rule number. I can't even remember what rule we're on <laughs> now. But someone has established themselves as grill master, you can't then come and challenge their position. Just because he left the grill unintended for a little while. Do you feel violated? Yes. <laughs> Have you put her in a place? It's the only time he does any cooking. How's the pressure feeling? <laughs> I just got shushed as well. There's 
couple of meat shots in this video. It's not one for the vegetarians. Meat. Maybe that's another rule of the barbecue. If you're vegetarian, you just kind of have to accept that there's going to be a lot of meat on show. And that you can have the salad, but... The salad and the cheese. The salad and the cheese. <laughs> I've come over to speak to the barbecue grill master and like I'm just getting smoked out. It's the way you keep people away. Mm. And your precious kingdom, your dominion. Is it dominion? Domain. Oh, well, that's professional. <laughs> <laughs> Pop it back on the barbecue. <laughs> it's another barbecue rule, remember? Never question the fact that the grill master is eating directly from the grill. And he's just, pl he's just placed it back in amongst the other food, so it's a bit of a lottery as to whether you're going to be getting Daryl spit on your rib or not. Hope but hey, sexy. remember rule number one or whatever it was that we made up? Can't question him, so if he wants to nibble all the food on the grill. Go right ahead. Barbecue rules are not the same as health and hygiene rules. <laughs> They're very different, aren't they, Lucy? We're, we're living on Daryl rules now. These are Daryl rules. <laughs> it's a scary land. I sort of don't feel like it's cooked enough if you're able to eat it directly off the barbecue. Just learnt a horrifying thing. It's definitely not making it into the barbecue rules. Daryl butters his bread for burgers. Do you butter bread for burgers? Why would you do that? Yeah, why Why would you do that? Do you, do you ask no, it for doesn't. them to butter it at McDonald's? Yeah. It's <laughs> fine, don't they? Well, from the outside, but it's what lurks inside. Should we open one up? Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. What is the appropriate time of the evening to undo your waistband? What's your barbecue verdict now? It's so good. Verdict, Lucy? It was alright, to be fair, yeah. <gasps> Only alright. Catherine? Lovely. Oh, and film Daryl again. And my verdict was very nice, thank you, Daryl. Stitch them all together and make an epic. And it's going to be Simon's Guide to Barbecues. Barbecue rules that everyone will adopt and follow, and then everyone will have the best barbecues ever because they finally have a set of guiding principles which is what the world has lacked until now. <laughs> that was a midge or a fly or something. I think I'd handle that well. <laughs> have another sausage. Have another sausage. Baby, baby says have another sausage. Baby wants a sausage. Oh, there she goes, get up. Oh, shuffle. Oh, listen to the chair creak. <laughs> Here endeth the barbecue. Good night.